Hi, it's Alex from LaughingPlace.com and our friends at Disney Cruise Line sent us this ginormous box with information about the Disney Destiny, the eighth ship being added to the Disney Cruise Line fleet. This is a sister ship to the Disney Wish and the upcoming Disney Treasure with the theme of heroes and villains. Let's take a look at what's inside this giant box. First up, it has a little bit of information on the inside of the box. Describes the word destiny, which is a noun if you didn't know. Two definitions for it, something to which a person or thing is destined, as in fortune. And number two, a predetermined course of events often held to be an irresistible hidden power of agency and fate. Uh, then it says myths and legends, fairy tales and fantasies. The Disney destiny will draw on the timeless tales of heroes and villains to introduce brand new experiences that celebrate the legacies and larger than life characters from Disney, Pixar, Marvel and beyond. This was sent specifically to our editor, Benji. And so there is a custom comic art featuring Benji's likeness. And the artwork teases some of the heroes and villains that we already knew were going to be part of this based on the animatic that Disney Cruise Line shared when they announced the name of the ship. That includes Hercules and Hades, Super Mini, Iron Man and Black Panther, Cruella de Vil, Maleficent, Edna Mode, and Simba and Scar. Also in the folio is an information card that says uncover your destiny July 30th, July 31st, and August 1st. And the card reads, as a first step on your journey, we invite you to celebrate some of the bold, charismatic, and driven characters at the heart of the stories coming to the Disney destiny with a graphic novel cover drawn by Disney comic artist Mariana Puglia. Your next step begins as you open the doors to reveal clues to the cast of legendary characters and experiences waiting on board the Disney destiny. Then discover the exhilarating feeling that comes with being the champion of one's own story by using what you've discovered to customize your exclusive Weekender travel bag. Your journey continues with an in-depth look at Disney Cruise Line's newest ship revealed in a unique three-day event. Tune in July 30th through August 1st on the Disney Parks blog to discover the different stories, characters, and itinerary information coming to the Disney destiny. The card mentioned a Weekender travel bag, and here it is. This is a customized bag by Bice, and it has the Disney Cruise Line logo here. It has both regular handles and a over-the-shoulder strap, and it has two nice spacious compartments, one on the top, the other one separate lock off from the bottom, and that bottom section is very sturdy. There are clues behind each of these porthole doors, which will be decorative items for that Weekender bag. So let's start opening them up. First up is a patch set with Captain Mickey and the Incredibles logo. The next one is a Black Panther and a Lion King Hakuna Matata patch. The third one is Loki's helmet from the Marvel comics and Vanellope Von Schweetz racer from Sugar Rush in Wreck-It Ralph. Fourth one is Jack-Jack from The Incredibles with an ice cream cone and the Disney Destiny logo. And last but not least, the patch of Super Mini and a ghost from the Haunted Mansion. These are all peel and stick patches, so it'll be a lot of fun to decorate this bag and especially to take it on board our first cruise aboard the Disney Destiny, which is launching in 2025. First is the Disney Treasure. As for the patches, there are some clues to things we didn't necessarily know for sure about the Disney Destiny. Based on the Hakuna Matata patch, I'm expecting that some of the Lion King spaces that are coming to the Disney Treasure may also be aboard the Disney Destiny. I'm assuming we'll see some of the same Marvel play areas and restaurant uh, that are on the Disney Wish and Disney Treasure coming to the Disney Destiny. The ice cream cone in Jack-Jack's hand implies that perhaps the self-serve, soft-serve ice cream on the top deck is going to be Incredibles themed. And then having the Vanellope Von Schweetz racer uh, makes me wonder if we won't have a version of Von Schweetz from the classic ships on board this one. The Haunted Mansion ghost uh, makes me think that the Haunted Mansion parlor that's coming to the Disney treasure might also be aboard the Disney Destiny. Captain Mickey you expect him on every ship. As for Super Mini, that could be a kids club space. She could be the statue in the atrium. Um, there's so many options that that could mean. I'm really excited to learn more about the Disney Destiny. And again, Disney Parks blog is going to be hosting a three day event that's gonna give us a lot more information. So definitely stay tuned to both Laughing Place and Disney Parks blog to get all your news about Disney Cruise Line. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Take care, bye.